Oh, it's time, baby. Oh, it's time. It's time for Metal Gym Reviews. How's it going? It's me, it's Metal Jim, the one and only, your uh, metal savior of all things metal that's not politically motivated. I don't know, whatever Logwire and Metal Injection is jerking off in each other's faces about, Oh, Corey Taylor said Trump this, and oh, he said Biden that. <laughs> it's time to review a music video. A music video called Save Yourself by Scream at the Sky. It's a, a band made by a guy named Brian Carter. So Brian Carter has been in a lot of bands. He was a bass player for Dead Horse Trauma. He was in Black 13 as, I believe, another bass player. And then um, there's another solo album that he did called A Little Bit of Brian Inside You. And it's just him solo bass playing. He doesn't sing, it's just like... So they just released this music video and we're gonna review it like the good people that we are. How does Metal Gym review music videos? Easy. Editing. Uh, does it look good? Does it sound good? All that stuff goes together because music videos are important to sell your product. And if you have a shitty music video, you're gonna have a shitty product. So let's review Save Yourself by Scream at the Sky. yourself, Metal Jim, did you forget to put the music video on? Or did you turn on um, an Atari game and, or some 80s game that goes pretty good to pretty steeper? No, that's the start of the song, and, uh, and that's it. I just wanted to explain that. Save yourself from this life. Save yourself from this nightmare. So the starting song starts off where he goes, Save yourself from this sounds I just that's how I sound um, and then it goes into um, uh, obviously Brian's really good at uh, scream voice as I like to call it metal scream 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 voice and um, and actually the song really takes off right away uh, you think uh, oh I'm about to play Atari then um, I don't know uh, E.T. comes out of the Atari system and punches you in the balls This lady who's addicted to heroin and he's screaming at her to save herself. She's, he's like, save yourself. In the meantime, I will tell you to save yourself. Therefore, I can take credit for saving you while saving yourself. Bright car, baby! Save yourself from this life. You wanna live, you wanna die, you take your life. Of course, Brian is singing, and there's the Texas flag in the background. Talk about state pride. Save yourself from this nightmare. Woo, Texas! And then he goes into the So the song is Save Yourself. Save yourself from this nightmare. Do you want to live? You want to die? And then for some reason they're holding up poster boards that says Save Yourself. Only you can change this. Don't think it's really necessary for the music video. I literally can hear you tell me that. That was Save Yourself by Scream at the Sky. Nah! That's how you do it.
Now you're probably asking yourself, why did Brian have so many wardrobe changes? Um, Take yourself, the one up inside. A lot of you don't know this, but a lot of his closest friends do, that Brian, um, it, it gets really sweaty in this area. But, uh, well, you'd call it sweat. It's actually not sweat. It's throw up. Um, Brian, when he gets excited or he screams or he loud, he goes, Burr! like a baby. You know how babies, when you pat him on the back, they go, Burr! and then, then puke runs down. That's why Brian's nickname in the business is Brian Baby Boy. Um, so if, if, if you want to help Brian when you see him live, and this is obviously post-pandemic, um, you want to go up to Brian, kiss him right on the forehead, kind of, and be like, my little Brian baby boy. And just, right here. Alright, time to review this. Is the song good? Yes, it is a banger. I like the song. It is fun to listen to. I've listened to it multiple times, and I just listen to it for fun and not just reviews. That's a good sign for a good music video. So good job, Brian, and the whole entire band. You, you made a banger. Uh, the editing and music video, yeah, it's, it's, it's a little all over the place when it comes to effects and stuff, but I think it adds to it, uh, kind of like when you're a drug addict, you're probably like... Blah, 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 blah. So uh, I think it adds to what the story is, so I actually, uh, at first I was like, Jesus, and then I was like, oh, okay, it adds to the story, so that's good too. I would say the only real bad thing about uh, the music video is the poster sign holding. I thought that didn't add to the music video at all, I thought it took away from it. Um, you're saying, save yourself on a poster board. Yeah, the whole song is called Save Yourself. You're literally telling people to save themselves. You're like, what if I put it on a poster board? What are you doing? It just didn't make sense. Uh, and the ending, where you hold the poster board at the end, too, I just felt like Brian just wanted to be in it more. He's probably like, hey, y'all, I don't want to be in this music video more. And the drummer's like, well, we can give you a poster board, I guess. And he's like, let's have it again. I give the music video an 8.3 out of 10. Good job. This has been Metal Gym Reviews. Check out Scream at the Sky, like all their stuff. The music video link is in below if you want to listen to it more. I will probably be on Spotify. Um, if it isn't, then I lied to you and I apologize. Remember to go to Brian's Facebook and Instagram and put hashtag Brian Baby Boy. He'll really appreciate it. It'll really make him feel humble and appreciated. So remember, it's hashtag Brian Baby Boy. It's pretty simple. Remember, this has been, you can ask Seth Peters. Um, if they've been calling him Brian Baby Boy since the start of Dead Horse Trauma, and anyone from Black 13. Thank you for watching. I love me! <laughs> ha!